How's it going everyone? Be Humble here and welcome back to our new Pokemon Snap playthrough. So in between episodes I figure out how you're supposed to lock the Illumina spots for both the reef area and the volcano area. So we will do the reef first this episode and then next episode do the volcano and also hit a couple of the level up courses that we haven't seen yet. So before we get to the underwater level let's go through the reef. And one thing too I want to say is that I finally figured out how to unlock the Illumina orbs uh, in between episodes as well for the reef area. So I'll show it to you guys when we uh, do the underwater course, but you have to take a picture of the crystal bloom in the underwater course. So I'll show you guys what area that is once we go through this. We got a little jumping torpedo to start off with though. Is anyone in here? There's gotta be something in there eventually. <laughs> Got that Winkle looking at us on the rock again. Anything else? Ooh, lots of Finneon here. Hello. That doesn't do much though. <laughs> oh, that Sharpedo's just looking for that Winkle. It wants a snack. You just look for a snack, are you, buddy? Well, that's cool. Anything like that? Ooh, little squirtles! Little squirtle over there, too. Hi, friends! Oh, they're so cute! Oh, we're gonna go in the whirlpool gun. Oh, these in there. Does that do anything different? Is it still just gonna be Magikarp? Yep, it's just Magikarp. I wonder if I had to like hit it with an orb plus that. Ooh, I did. I hit it. That didn't really do much though. <laughs> and we got these guys just over here. There's probably things I'm like missing. No, I want to throw the orb! No! Whoops. What if I hit you with that? Does that do anything? I don't think that did anything. <laughs> there's a giant whale lord there now. Ooh, there's another one over here. Ooh, go this way now. What if I hit you with this? Ooh, gotta get the yawn. Do it again. Oh my god, that is quite the yawn. <laughs> oh, look at the Pelipper's just hanging out. Can I hit you? Ooh, I actually did. Good job, me. <laughs> Still got this Machamp just doing exercises by himself. <laughs> You're just chilling here, aren't you? Gosh, that mouth. <laughs> what if I hit you guys with some orbs? Oh, so happy. They just happy. So we got lots, lots of birds in the sky at this time. Oh, hello. I just missed you doing a loop de loop. What else is going on here? Nothing too much behind me. Oh, I missed it. Whoops. What if I hit you with some orbs? Oh, that's cute. Oh, I love that. What if I hit you guys? Run, Corsola, run! Oh gosh, that one just hopped over it. Well, good for you guys. Just got a cute little Corsola hanging out there. 
if I like trick shot you over here. Nice. Got that one in at the last second. I totally missed the the uh, split in the course again. Oh well. Another time. <laughs> All right, let's see what we got here and show the professor. All right, we got our photos here. Let's show the professor. Not too many new ones, but hopefully some improvements on poses here. Can we actually get diamond? Yes. There we go. And we got a Squirtle. This is our first time seeing Squirtle, so that's exciting. Nothing, nothing crazy. This is only a one star, which boggles me, but I'll take it. I'll take mouth wide open. <laughs> and nice, we got a gold star finally for that. So we just gotta get the diamond still. Ooh, four star diamond. I like that. That's so cool. <laughs> the Pukamuku just giving the peace sign. I love it. <laughs> All right, so that was the new reef course. Ooh, we got a pre -usant. All right, cool. Got some icons there. Let's go back to camp and then go into the underwater level next. All right. Let's get this show on the road. Lentil Seafloor. Underwater, level two. Let's do this. Oh, we got that pelipper diving right there. Is it chasing the love disc? Is that thing really chasing the love disc? Oh my gosh. <laughs> pelipper, you monster. So a lot more fish out. Ugh. Oh, we got a little Finneon hiding. So lots more Pokemon visible this time around. So I have to be on the look for a Claw Litzer, I think, to break this path. But I did not see a Claw Litzer here. Hmm. Figure it out, I guess. Was that Creedy Lee? Hi, friend. Am I stuck? <laughs> there you are. Hi. Who is more Creedy Lee? So there's actually a Lumini on there. You have to hit that thing with a fluff fruit in order to access the. Um, the crystal bloom it's sleeping on. So, if you are needing to know how to do that, that's how you do it. I just love how these Cordelia are just here. I read on the internet you're supposed to re uh, hit a Colitzer to break the rocks back there, but maybe I can't do it yet. I don't know. Have to play around with this a little bit more if we don't unlock the next area after we finish this level two. This way we're just screeching. I was just having a temper tantrum. <laughs> oh, are all these whalers now? These were Sharpedo last time. Love it. Do it again. Do it again. You're not gonna do it again, are you? Nope. Ooh, call it sir. That's a call it sir though. Maybe I need you, friend. Should probably take a photo of it first. <laughs> Oh, 
Where are you going? Don't run away from my boy. There's like a couple collets over there. There's a couple quillfish down here. Oh, are they having like a gunfight? Am I in the middle of a gunfight right now? <laughs> there you go. Oh, we got some Magikarp and Love Disc over here this time. Got some Love Disc hiding over there. <laughs> Can't look down. Got a Magikarp though. Get back here. Take my orbs, will you? There's a Crystal Bloom right there. Look at them, they kissing. Oh, that's so cute. Oop, didn't like that one. Apparently, if you do the scan feature, they spin, which is pretty cool. I didn't know that before. All right, so some new things here. So that's pretty exciting. Let's see. Let's see what we can do here. All right, I got a couple photos to show here. Nothing too crazy though. All right, so first one is a new Pelipper. At least we got all the photo decks pages for Pel Pelipper. That's pretty cool. Come on, this one's gotta be so much better. All right, gold, I'll take it. Alright, Credilly here. I just like this one. It's just up in its face. <laughs> Probably not gonna be worth a lot, but still. Oh, okay. Give me that two star diamond. I'll take that. <laughs> we got Call. Let's see here of the gunfight. Alright, alright. I'll take it. I'll take it. And then we got this tentacle. Oh, that one's not worth as much as the other. Interesting. I thought it'd be the opposite. All right, we got a rock collector. I guess because of the Cradily. So something tells me I didn't hit the target on what I needed to do. So let me go back and try to figure this out. So I'm so mad at myself right now. I thought I was recording and found the way to get into the underwater or the um, alternate part of the course and OBS never recorded. <laughs> so yay, that's fun. But basically to get to the, um, the alternate part of the course at the beginning of the level, I completely missed it, I guess, the first time I was playing. There is a collet, so we're literally dead in front of you um, as you're kind of going towards the reef. If you follow it and hit it with the orbs, um, it'll eventually lead itself to the cave where it will smash the rock in order for you to get down that area. But yeah, uh, OBS is not uh, liking me today, apparently. So I'm a little bit sad about that. <laughs> But uh, here are some photos we took. <laughs> we have the back side of the collector that uh, smashed the rock for us. <laughs> and then some more tentacle doing their, doing their thing. Ooh, we have got all diamond on tentacle so far. Nice. We got a chin chow. We finally saw some chin chow. Ooh, nice diamond one. I'll take that. We got frillish. We got the male and female frillish here. All right, all right. This should have been diamond, just saying. Lantern, far away. Couldn't really do anything about that. But at least we got it in the decks now. And then we got clear pearl, which I could not figure out how to get them out of the ground. I'm assuming I couldn't do that yet. 
So we just got the top part of their shells there. <laughs> and then underwater we also had those glissopods that just were sleeping the whole time. Couldn't figure out how to wake them up either, so... And then we just have another Cordelia here. Ooh, a diamond. Both diamond and Cordelia too, nice. Ooh, almost level three. We got under the sea. And then water collector. And we just got new icons. By the way, thanks to your progress you've made in your research, I got something to report. All right, let's go back to the camp and see what he has in store for us here. All right, back at the lab. Did you pull off some special feed again? The professor's been frantically analyzing the data you sent back. Professor, did you find figure anything out? I may have. Do you remember those ruins on the seafloor? I'm certain now that are connected to the Illumina Pokemon. And if and as to prove it, we've picked up more of those energy readings that we've been seeing. All right, we finally got the Illumina spot. They're coming from the ocean depths beyond the ruins. Guess it means Captain Vince, Captain Vince couldn't have gotten there a hundred years ago. Good thing we got the Neo one. Time to get to work. All right, let's see what this Illumina Pokemon is. Cause I'm very curious which one it is. I don't know if this will be the Lugia. I think Alugia is one of the legendaries you see in the course. We'll see though. Ooh, nice and dark. So dark. Ooh. Oh, was that a wishy washy? Yep, it was. Oh, do we get to see them actually come together? Do I have to hit them? Yes, Ania wants fine, not me. <laughs> Did I hit you guys or something? Come on. Ooh. That one ran off. That one's ran off too. All right. That one's gonna run off now. I'm trying. Ooh. Oh, they're all going together now. I bet we're gonna see a giant fish in a sec. Where are you? There you are. <laughs> there it is. Look at that giant whale of a Pokemon. <laughs> Do you like music? Do you like Fuffert? I did. Hello. Where are you going? Don't leave me. Don't leave me. Oh, hello. Oh, I have to do this again. Oh, so many wishy wishy. Wishy washy. It's a crystal bloom. That doesn't do anything though. Oh, they're so happy. Oh. 
What, do I hit all of them in the school? Oh gosh. I think they're all, okay, they're all getting over there. Perfect. Is this where the wishy-washy was gonna be? Oh, yep. Hello. Did I hit it? I don't think I hit it. Come on. You know you want these orbs. Come on. Take it. Oh my goodness, <laughs> really? There we go. Finally hit it. Oh, goodbye. I don't even know what's going on anymore. I'm just like, there's a wishy washy. Everywhere. <laughs> Come on. Do I really have to hit this whole entire school wishy washy? There, hit you. I'm getting it, I'm getting it. I just don't know how many times I have to keep doing this. Come on, big fish. There you go. Here, have some more Illuminors. <laughs> Ooh, you're circling, aren't ya? Where are you going? Oh, is that it? Is that it now? I have no idea where I am. <laughs> you guys want some orbs? Guess I should take a photo of that. Do I have to get all these guys lit up here? Come on. <laughs> I feel like I'm hitting the same ones over and over here. Oh, I think I got it though. <laughs> well, this is a long one. <laughs> this is much longer than the other two that we've done so far. <laughs> I'm assuming this is towards the end though. Oh, big boy, come here. Oh god, I almost got eaten. Coming over here. Where are you going? Where are you? Where are you? Oh, there you are. <laughs> I think that's it. Maybe. Hello? Here? Oh god. Where are you? <laughs> Where'd it go? <laughs> yes, it was. I, I concur. 
Oh, jeez. Well, that was a uh, quite the long one there. So let's select a wishy-washy first. Oh, I can't take a normal photo of it. That's a three star. Okay, I can only do three star. That's the highest. Oh God. That one's a little too zoomed up, I think. That That's a nice pretty one. Let's do that one. And then I don't know the crystal blooms. We already have that. All right, got a nice wishy-washy doing a giant back spin there. Nice. All right, all right, got two level two on that Illumina spot. Great. Ruler of the deep sea. Ooh, we got like a sepia tone. All right, now that I got a Lumina Pokemon, I've got something to report. All right, well, let's head back to the lab and see what the professor has before we end the episode. I think in the next one, we will do the volcano area. Um, I believe we can finally get to a lot of Lumina spot there. And we'll also see what the sands courses look like. Um, I think we upgraded both the day and night ones. So we'll try that out next episode too. Another island, another amazing Illumina Pokemon. That's right, it's just like the travel log said. Every part of Lentil is home to its own Illumina Pokemon. The question is, how could Captain Vince have found that out? He only wrote about meeting two Illumina Pokemon, right? Yes, and he also wrote that there were four. Hmm. The mysteries just keep piling up. Indeed, that's what makes this so intriguing. Is that it? All right, that seems to be it. So thank you guys for watching and uh, we'll pick this up in the next episode with the volcano era. So I'll see you guys next time. Remember, stay kind and be humble.